Alrighty, we've loosened the front cross, the transmission motor, transmission cross member, and I've got it supported here with a jack in the back. When we let the jack down, you should watch it fall out. Of course, it doesn't. We'll help it a little bit here. There it goes. Now, collect up all your metal washers. Pull your cross member out. Collect up your rubber brow or your rubber grommets. Yeah, it's up. now that leaves the transmission hanging by one bolt there, that bolt up there, and that bolt over there. And we're gonna start on the top side. That bolt, that bolt, that bolt there, and then that one there, and then behind this plate we gotta take this, we gotta take this whole transmission support bracket out of the way. There's a bolt down in there, that's for it too. Then we leave this harness alone because it runs up, runs this, runs the uh, ignition, timing, uh, the grounds, Temperature sensor, all that fun stuff. Throttle position sensor, uh, map sensor, and all that fun stuff. This harness we leave alone. This lower one here runs the starter, the starter alternator, and the oil 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 sensor down there. We got to pull this, pull this assembly out, or pull the starter bracket starter. Pull the 13 millimeter on the starter, and the and the ignition wire for it. Your speedometer cable. Yeah, we're almost there. A couple more bolts. 20, 30 more minutes. We're done. Throw the summit on the ground. Then we get to do the autopsy on it. That's gonna be fun. <laughs> Bye.